mencegah ataupun menolak rasuah. So today it is the turn of the uh, elected representative including ministers the deputy prime minister and the prime minister is uh, uh, expected to hear the taklimat uh, unfortunately i have been given this taklimat many times by uh, tan sri abu kasim so i know what he is going to say so i will not be present but that does not mean i do not know what he is going to say because I have got the briefing already from him. But apart from that, of course, all the members of parliament of the government party will be uh, hearing the briefing to be done by Datuk Sri Abu Qasim. Tan Sri Abu Qasim. So this is not the first step. We have already done a lot of work to prevent uh, corruption in this country. Then saya Semalam kita mengadakan mesyuarat Jawatan uh, Kota Khas Kabinet mengenai rasuah And all the KSUs and all that attended So we are going all out to prevent rasuah uh, From happening in this country Hopefully uh, we will at least succeed some way uh, towards achieving that objective. Itu sajalah kalau ada soalan boleh. Sir, do you think that you have done enough to actually stop your MPs from committing rasuah? I cannot know whether I have done enough until I find them breaking the law. They break the law means I have done enough. <laughs> uh, sir, um, so yesterday you mentioned something about uh, asset declaration for all the water rights. So this declaration will it uh, be to the public or to relevant authorities and why the decision? Yeah, because this involves a lot of persons, including the family of uh, the lawyer. Yeah. We are uh, considering with how much we can reveal to the public because uh, it may affect the privacy of lots more members of the family. So many, uh, how many have declared their assets so far? None. 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 Uh, Prime Minister, as far as I know. <laughs> Prime Minister, is there a deadline for this uh, declaration of assets, uh, falling on of that? And is there any plans for the government to raise the salaries of ministers and MPs, considering that they actually lower than private sector? Yeah, we have no date just yet, but we will determine the time given for the assets to be declared. As far as raising the salary is concerned, I know the salary is very low compared to the private sector. Uh, we don't want to be below the private sector too much, so we are reducing the salary of the private sector. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know that some members, uh, some of the people who run some of the government co government link company, get as much as seven million ringgit per year? That's how much they get. Compared to doctors and lawyers, the the salary of MPs are still much lower. Yeah, much lower, but not too low. I, as Prime Minister, my pay when I stepped down was $20,000 a month. Very much below some of the people in Proton, for example. But I find that $20,000 is more than enough for me. Why? It's because the government gives you a house, pay for the electricity and the water, gives you transport, provide you with my uh, traveling allowance, everything was paid for, so much so that for 29 years, I did not spend my salary. I kept my salary, that's the money that I have now. Because uh, everything is paid for by the government. I don't know about uh, Wakil Rakyat, Wakil Rakyat, much less. Huh? <coughs> but uh, we are now giving them, uh, to, to facilitate their work, we are giving them some money, to have an office and to 
run in office and all that. When I was prime uh, member of parliament before, there was no such thing. So we have actually given them some aid, some help. Yeah. Uh, so, the uh, 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 Tak peduli parti lawan ke, parti kerajaan ke, dia orang tinggi ke, rendah kita tak kira. Termasuk kerajaan negeri juga. Tapi kerajaan negeri yang terdiri daripada Pakatan Harapan, mereka akan menurut tindak, tindak, tindakan yang dibuat oleh Pakatan Harapan di peringkat pusat. Decisions are not so easily made. When we make a decision and announce it, uh, the market reacts negatively. The market apparently likes to be told lies about how good everything is, so they will give you good marks. But if you tell them that we have discovered a lot of wrongdoings, uh, they react by uh, they, uh, running away with the money, they stop uh, investing and all that. But in fact, what we are doing now is to ensure that this country is financially is run properly. That's what we are. They should appreciate it. But the initial uh, reaction is, oh, they owe $1 trillion. Oh, let's get out of here. So that is the reaction. So when we make an announcement, we have people who react negatively. So that that is why we have to be very careful about what we say. And as far as uh, the uh, Singapore Singapore government is concerned, we have not no given them full notice yet, but they know what we want to do. And what is it that you want to do regarding the Chesapeake? <laughs> I think you should read your own press. Last like two questions, please. <laughs> Kemudian Ketua Menteri Pindeng Pembagal Pembagal Jantar pula Sebab yang akan menjelaskan hubungan dengan India Kemudian uh, Pertemuan Tuan dengan Lok Seraka Naik pada dulu mulai Adakah kaitan dengan Kata tersebut ataupun Perkaitan secara lain Kita Tak selalunya Terpaksa ikut Kehendak orang lain Kita kena tentukan sebab-sebab yang kita respon kepada mana-mana uh, uh, apa nama desakan sama ada dia mengikut undang-undang ataupun tidak kalau tidak ada orang akan jadi mangsa last question please betul ketua tetol boleh bagi wish kita kepada apa dia boleh bagi wish share i i wish that the press will help us overcome uh, Raswa. Thank you. Beza banyak dulu. Tak minat melap begitu banyak Raswa dahulu. Masa saya jadi Perdana Menteri pada tahun 1981, saya masuk keadaan jentera kerajaan bersih. As bersih as it could be. Lah. Adalah. Tapi tak lama lagi. Ini kita dapati dengan kerana Datuk Sri Najib promotes rasuah. Dia kata cash is king. Kita dapati habis jentera kerajaan pun terlibat. Dan kita nak kena pilih. Nak kena tapis. Sebelum kita ambil tindakan Sebaliknya Kalau pun kita suspek Kita tak boleh buang semua Pegawai kerajaan yang kita suspek Kerana demikian Kita tak ada jentera Nak nak tolong jalankan Tugas dan arahan-arahan kita 
Oke, okay, terima kasih. Terima kasih kepada semua pengawal media. Terima kasih kepada Yang Maha Muhammad, Dato' Mahathir Muhammad. Terima kasih kepada Yang Maha Muhammad, Dato' Sri Dato' Mahathir.